Hey, this is A, and welcome to AG Perspective. This is my first ever video, and I'm going to be reviewing Destiny Beta. Destiny is a game developed by Bungie, the same developers who made Halo, Halo 2, Halo 3, Halo Reach, and a bunch of other great games. Destiny is very similar to Bungie's other games. Uh, it has a very similar uh, Halo post-apocalyptic feel, but it had a nice Call of Duty mix or a Battlefield mix. Uh, it actually focused more on the guns instead of just alien warfare. And the nice uh, two mix of elements is very, very appealing and actually brings many different gamers together. And it's overall very uh, smooth. When you first start off the Destiny beta, you start off with a uh, character selection and you have three class options. You have a Warlock, a Hunter, and a Titan, each one with different abilities. Uh, it brings a nice variation and not, and it's all pretty balanced. Not one is better than the other. And when you start off the game, it doesn't really affect which one you pick. It just gives you different ways to approach something. Destiny uh, takes off when a, a robot called a ghost finds you in a post-apocalyptic Earth. Uh, it's telling you to go to uh, the Traveler, which is a nice uh, machine orbiting Earth that is trying to recover from an alien race. When you get to the Traveler, it's asking you to become a guardian and save the human race. And that's basically the plot. You go around Earth destroying and destroying like mother bases of aliens and helping each other campaign as you progress you actually are able to play with your friends and continue the campaign with your friends it makes it a lot easier and more fun it makes the game very interactive and even if you don't like for some reason have any friends you can play with random people who join the lobby with you and play the campaign and then there's the multiplayer where it's just pretty much in call of duty terms like a domination Whereas three bases, you gotta take control of them, and whoever has more control wins the game. It's a six on six game, and it has a really uh, good online featuring and nice, uh, smooth gameplay. Uh, the, it's very balanced the way that the game is set up, and I think it's a really good game. Online, each class is very equal, like I said before, but they really, really uh, make it equal by doesn't matter what level you are, if you have the skills, you can beat someone who's a higher level than you. And if you're higher level, of course, you beat someone that's lower level. It all depends on the skill, mostly. Of course, the leveling up does help you, but it's not a great advantage. Unlike Call of Duty, that you like prestige and like go crazy with like buying all the perks and upgrades and all the kill streaks. This is more uh, straight up go kill someone if you know how to shoot and perfectly on someone's head. You can play really well. There are many Easter eggs uh, in Destiny. You can find them in campaigns, missions, in the Traveler. Uh, you, it's by reviving these dead ghosts. And when you revive a dead ghost, it actually gives you a nice uh, little snippet of the history behind the game. Showing you like why these aliens came and took over, how it happened, what happened to the human race. And it's really, uh, it really brings out the story. and makes you feel connected to the game. Remember, this is only a beta. And not all the stories and missions and online is final. But from what I've seen and played, I think it's very, very uh, good. And the beta hopefully lives up to the game. So if you want a Call of Duty, Battlefield, and Halo mix with a little twist, this is the game for you. So the release date of Destiny is September 9th, 2014. And if you're as pumped for the game as I am, leave a like, comment, and share this video with your friends. Thanks for watching my first video. This has been A from AG Perspectives. If you want us to review a game, please leave in the comment section below. And if you want to follow us, please subscribe so you can see our further content. Peace!